This is a quick video to show you how to reduce the spacing or the padding in a MailChimp website. Into your MailChimp account, go over to the left-hand menu, over to website, and click on website, and then edit site. And you're going to edit the pages that are on the site. They're all sort of like shown in a list. So I'm gonna click on home. And once this loads, you'll see that you have some like circular arrows that drag up and down. And so the person that was asking about this, they couldn't see those arrows and sometimes you can't see them. Um, but if you just hover over here, they're right here and you can drag these up and down to make more or less space. And so every section inside your website, it, it has one of these. So you can drag it up and down. You can't go any tighter, like there's a set limit that you can do as far as condensing it, um, but you can make them pretty wide or pretty tall. And here in the footer, like sometimes this can get a little bit crazy. There's like so much space here. But so that is the arrow and then we'll hop on over to editing the section so you can see the other place to edit. So the other place that you can adjust the padding or the spacing in between your sections is over here in edit styles. So if you're on your pages, you'll just click edit styles. And then you have all these sections, all of these sections. These are all these different sections of your website. If you click on one, I'm going to click on header. There's also padding um, sometimes by default here. So you can remove that as well. And you'll see it's starting to pat, put everything together. And I can just click through um, and look for any padding that's in those sections. And you'll see everything starting to condense. No padding there. So just go through all of these sections, remove all the padding. And then what you can do is you can use this to, to get like a visual of how much padding you want, or you can set them inside here. So that's up here. This is the header. I wish this was labeled actually. I hope that helped. If you're still having trouble reducing the padding on your MailChimp website, feel free to shoot me an email or leave a comment here. Thanks.